Hey, strap on your helmet, Team Victory members. Today is a full tutorial and playthrough of this awesome old school Valley solid state table, Evil Knievel. We're gonna do that right here, right now, on Digital Victory. This is Evil Knievel from Bally from 1977. This particular table is the biggest mod 2.1 and it's really good. I've gone through several versions of this table and this version by far is the best one. So let's take a look at some of these elements here. Most noticeable is that saucer up top. Now that saucer will award a letter from the word super whenever you drop the ball in there and you see in the middle of the table you see super here and each time you drop it in the saucer one of those letters will light once you light the whole thing you are awarded a special what do you get with the special well you get a free game i know it's virtual pinball so that doesn't mean much but that's what you get now there's also the letters on the table that say cycle and you'll see them there the c and the y up top over the rollovers and the cle on the right on those targets they all start out lit and when you hit them, they go out. Once you knock out the whole bank, you'll like the specials on the out lanes here. Now, in addition to the saucer up there, which lights up one of those super letters, you can also hit that target in the middle. Now you see that orange arrow on the left pointing to the S? Well, that will show which letter lights up when you hit that target. You see on the left, there's another whole bank of targets right there. Five targets. When you knock down the whole bank of targets, you double your bonus. You'll light up that green light there for double bonus. If you're able to knock it down a second time, the entire bank, you're awarded an extra ball. That's always great. You know that's something I always chase. And finally, knock that entire bank down one more time and you're awarded a special, which is a free game. Most everything on the table, the targets there, the targets there, the letters, will give you 500 points and advance the bonus. The exception is the drop hole up top. That saucer, you'll get 3,000 points for that. Now advancing the bonus is shown here and it goes up to 10,000, but if you keep getting more bonus points, it goes up another five. So you'll total 15,000 points maximum. You'll see both lit, the 10,000 and the 5,000 lit when you max it out. Now up top, you see you got that group of three bumpers. They're worth 100 points when they're not lit, but when you light them up, they're worth 1,000. Now the final element of the table is the spinners. You have a spinner on the left and a spinner on the right. Those give you minor points for knocking it through and getting the spins, except when one is lit. Now you see that one on the right there has got that white light lit up there. That gives you a thousand points per spin. All right, so that's a big deal. If you can always keep track of which side is lit and aim for it on a regular basis, you can score a lot of points. Now, what are the keys to Evil Knievel? Number one, try and get that extra ball. I always chase the extra ball when I can. You gotta knock down that bank of targets on the left twice to score the extra ball. It's very difficult though, because the outlanes, especially the left one, are very hungry and they'll take the ball every time they can. So be prepared to give it a good solid nudge anytime it starts going over there. Number two, hit those spinners because it takes the ball up top. And every time it gets up top, you have a real good chance of dropping in that saucer, which is 3,000 points, and it spots a letter. That leads to number three, and number three is watch out for that lit spinner and bang that lit spinner every single time you can. To be honest with you, everything else is kind of moot. The lit spinner is the key to scoring high points on this game, and in competitions, that's almost exclusively what they aim for. That said, it's an awesome table and just really fun to play. And the artwork is great. I think Biggest did a great job with this 2.1 mod. Let's try and get 200 grand. Now you get a free game at 100 grand, but we're going for 200 grand. All right, let's do it. Evil Knievel, let's go. Nice. I will not shy away from aiming to those spinners whenever I have a chance. Ooh, careful. Yeah. 
you know, it's almost better to move it over there. Yeah, well, that was ugly. Tried to get it to that left or to the right flipper. Get in there. All right, I am one away from the double bonus. That's pretty important. I got, hey, there we go. All right. <laughs> that helped. Spinner, please. No, but I got a target down at least. Oh, come on. That was tough. I had a little something going on there. I was only two targets away from an extra ball. Dang it. Shoot. Not a terrible first ball, though. Yikes. Well, got a long way to go on this last ball. 200K seems a long ways away. But stranger things have happened. One might say, you never know. And keep going in there, that's fine. That's uh, pretty solid at 3,000 per. Get it for a good rip here. Oh, shoot. All right. Do I go for the two targets or do I go straight for the spinner? That's tough. I'm going for the targets. And I missed them. Targets. There's one. Oh! <laughs> I should have gone for the spinner. Dang. Didn't get the 200K. Didn't get the target. But hey, that's pinball. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something in the tutorial. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.